guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Caitlin. I make videos about wife life, motherhood, and lifestyle. And today I have a lot of cleaning to do. And I'm gonna get really down and dirty and show you guys some things that I'm a little bit embarrassed by, but I think it's gonna be really satisfying for you guys. And it definitely needs to be done. So I hope you guys enjoy this filthy, disgusting, deep cleaning video. I hope it gives you lots of cleaning motivation and helps you feel better, a bit better about your own house and your own mess. If you guys are new here, I would love for you to stick around and hit that subscribe button. If you enjoy cleaning motivation, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. And yeah, if you guys are ready for some cleaning motivation, keep watching. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna tackle is I would say the absolute worst. It is our fan that's in our kitchen. And if you get real close like I am getting, it's extremely dusty. And it's so bad, you guys. And in my defense, we don't ever use this fan. In fact, I always forget that it's even here. And yeah, it's just literally collecting dust, clearly. So we're gonna take care of that. Also, it's actually the only fan we have in this house, so we don't have ceiling fans in our home. It's an older home, so it only came with this one in the kitchen. So we're not really used to using ceiling fans, so it just doesn't get used. But it has piled up this dust, and I can't believe I haven't noticed it sooner. I am so excited to get that cleaned up because that's so nasty. Um, but I'm going to use a trick that I saw on a YouTuber's cleaning video about basically dusting the fan wing with a bag. So the whole point of this bag trick is so that the dust would fall into the bag instead of all over into the air. However, this dust had been so built up, I could barely even get it off with the bag. So I end up going to grab a towel and kind of scraping it off that way. But I do think that this bag could work for just like an everyday or you know weekly type of dusting from the ceiling fan. Obviously I let mine build up way too long.
while I was up there cleaning the fan, I did notice there was some dust built up on the ceiling as well. So I thought the easiest way to take care of this would be just sweep it off with a broom and it did do a good job and you can just tell how much better this whole area looks. It's just a lot cleaner and dust free. Okay, moving on to disgusting thing number two that we're gonna clean is our toilet brush and toilet holder. I just think I keep putting this off, but it definitely needs a good scrub. That's absolutely disgusting. I could just buy a new one, but we'll see if we can give it a good cleaning and save it. this toilet brush with a towel but the towel just kept getting caught on the bristles so I just felt like I had to go in with my hands I know it's so gross but I just really wanted to try to give this the best like scrubbing that I could and I have to say I've never had my toilet brush stain like this but I'm wondering if it's because I switched toilet bowl cleaner so I can't wait to get back to my old toilet bowl cleaner because I feel like it just did a better job. Okay, if you guys couldn't tell how nasty our bathroom sink was looking, we are going to be tackling this next. Um, my kids just recently got their face painted and they were cleaning, washing their faces in the sink. So I think that's what some of this is. But yeah, definitely needs a good cleaning. Let's get to it. This town's so
So this faucet is clearly an older faucet. We actually are planning to replace it for a black one to match the accents that we put in the bathroom now. So I'll be thrilled to be switching this out soon. Until then, it is kind of hard to clean around the edges. Um, I know once you take out a faucet, you can see all the gunk that's left underneath and I cannot wait to clean that all up. Well guys, that is going to wrap up this dirty, filthy, disgusting clean with me. I hope you guys enjoyed and were inspired by this cleaning motivation. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!